Now, once again, because we're in the hard end of the questions, very careful reading is required. In fact, you always need to read carefully, but extra special care this time. So, Alex gets X amount of rabbit food for bunnykins every week. What was the killer things there? It's X amount and every week. Heather, his friend, buys Y amount of guinea pig food every month, month, for piggykins. Bunnykins and piggykins. Oh dearie me, honestly. Bunnykins and piggykins. Mine, at least they make sense. We've got a chicken called Duncan, who's a girl. She's so cute. We've got a little girl guinea pig called Colin. In fact, we've got very gender confused animals in our house. How, anyway, back to the question. How much do they together buy per year? Right, now, let's have a look. So, Bunnykins gets X amount of food every week. How many weeks are there in a year? 52, make sure you know that. So it's 52 X. Happy with that? Because it's 52 weeks and each week she gets X amount. Now you could write X times 52, but think of it as apples. You would just say 52 apples. You don't go apples times 52, which means the same thing. You just don't say it, do you? So write it in the same way here. And then his friend Heather buys Y amount every month. How many months in a year? That's right. So we also want her stuff, the plus means and, 12 lots of Y. Now you could have it the other way around, 12 Y plus 52 X, there's no reason why you can't do that. It's just, if all else is equal, it kind of feels more elegant to have the X's first and then the Y's, because that's the alphabetical order, there's no reason why. So, ooh, a little random line turned up. So is that the first one? No. Is that the second one? 52y, no, because that's um, second one. Yes, yeah, C, isn't it? Where we've got our 52x plus 12y. Often causes a lot of trouble, that. So if it causes trouble for you, you're in good company.